What's up everybody, it is Daydreams, thanks for coming back to the channel for another Clash Royale video. If you're new here, please tell your clan about the channel. We're doing streams, we're doing giveaways, we're doing all kinds of tournaments here on the channel. We're having a lot of fun and we're trying to grow in the Clash Royale community. We've already taken over the Clash of Kings community, so now we're going into Clash Royale, going into the deep waters, trying to grow there. And uh, I know it's going to be a long road, but if I've got your guys' support and we do these tournaments all the time and stuff, I think we're going to grow. So... As you guys know, I love this deck right here. It's such a great deck, but the problem is, is that everybody's using it now. Like, literally everybody's using it. So, let's take a look at what's in it. The Hog Rider. Skeleton Army. Ice Spirit. Princess. All this stuff can be killed by Bowler. So, this deck right here counters it pretty well, really. It counters that deck well. You can Lightning, like, the Princess, uh, the Ice Wizard, and then you know, the tower, or any, you know, it's just a great deck, um, it's a 3.9 deck, it's a little expensive, but, you know, I think it's gonna work good, so we're gonna go ahead and try it in some live battles, I played one with it, and won, so I'm gonna see how I do in some live battles, let's do it, let's get live, alright, by the way, it's, um, yeah, 1am, so we're gonna be facing mostly Chinese and Korean players who, you know, they're good, and I don't know how else to put it, they're good. Alright. I hate how the log destroys your, uh... Alright, so he's a little ahead in damage, but nothing crazy. So, actually, this is the type of deck that's going to be a little bit hard to play against. You know what? He's going to attack that tower. We're going to go this way. <laughs> Now we've got to get our musketeer down behind it. If not, we'll get the mega minion. I'd like to get both. We'll play her. Right there. The bowler does really good against skeleton army, and everyone's using it right now. And the everyone uses the Mega Minion, they always have, and the Musketeer does a good job against the Mega Minion, so we should get a couple shots off here. I don't know how oh good good play. I don't know how they're getting so much damage over here on this uh tower. Be ready to play this bowler right now. I mean, I shouldn't even have played that log. That was a waste of a log. Let that die out. We're gonna have to win it on this push. I'm gonna put this Mega Minion right there. I hate using arrows on that princess. We just gotta get back to the lightning. I almost lost that. I didn't even know we were down to 92. How did we get more damage on it? I thought it was at like 250. I need to know the exact damage the lightning does and the arrows do. That's something you have to like know in your decks. So the log does... How much crown tower? 115 damage for the log. I should be writing this down. Um, crown tower damage, 346. Okay. 
346 and 107 so okay that's good to know that's good to know so we actually have two princess counters which is nice you know it's nice to have that and that also counters the they both counter the okay let me show you they both counter princess and skeleton army really well then the log can push back the hall grader or knock out the ice spirit and then if that happens i still have the arrows not to mention the bullard is really good against that stuff too so i think this is a really good deck to go against that and then the lightning if you get a good opportunity or if someone's like playing with the three musketeers it's such a good uh, one so let's just keep playing with it it's it's a fun deck if anything it's fun i don't know if it's that great but if anything it's fun and i'm playing against good competition everyone i'm playing against is in the upper three thousands to over four thousand trophies even so i'm not playing scrubs um we're gonna play tombstone okay my gosh, they both moved at the last second. How does that happen? That was so bad, guys. They both moved. Oh, I so I gotta be more aware of that. Uh, I don't know if that was a worse wall deal. He's gonna use an ice spirit on my last one here, though. Lumberjack, huh? I didn't have anything to deal with that. So it's an even trade. It's not like it's a... You know, negative elixir trade. We're ahead in damage. I can't be too stressed. But, okay, we know what he's got. He's running a musketeer and... Got that tower, I think. All right, good. Spend some time chopping him up. Lumberjack's good, man. Look how quick he chops that bad boy up. Please tell me that I kill that guy. That's all right. I'll, I'll take that trade any day. Um. I don't know if that, yeah, that wasn't a counter, but... We're gonna go ahead and push the other lane. I could've got crown power damage too right there, but... It's okay, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be happy with that. I don't know how to get to that musketeer, and I don't want to take down my mega minion. I didn't even know my power was so low. That's okay, we're ahead in damage, and I guarantee we're ahead in elixir. Well, we got his uh, main power down too. Why isn't, oh no, our giant's gonna get melted. Why isn't, why did our musketeer go way over there? This, this push should win it for us. I'm gonna save up for the lightning. Good and drop something. Gonna get a couple. There we go, we got it. So, I mean, I'm sure these guys have decent trophies and stuff. Or, you know, I guarantee I'm not playing against scrubs, but I just feel like I'm making bad decisions a lot. Fourth, see, I'm playing 4K players too. 4K, 
3,800. All higher than me. And I'm beating him. So that should try, show you that trophy counts don't mean everything. 3,500 beat him too. So we're 3-0 in the grand challenge with the deck. We'll play with it again. Um, you know, I just feel like I could be winning easier. This is a very good anti-meta deck if you guys... Um, you guys should use it. And I know the giant got nerfed. I'm not playing giant poison. This deck used to have poison in it. But, um... Yay. Okay, we're probably going to be playing that same deck again. Now, I could go ahead and log now or arrow now. But I'll just wait. Like, I could even lightning. I'm going to lightning that. Oh no, this ain't good, this ain't good. Give me an elixir, give me an elixir. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. I need elixir, I need elixir. How does he got so much? Okay, he only got one dog. Oh no, this is bad. Please kill the princess. Okay, we got the princess. Alright, let's reset. Um, this guy definitely doesn't have... Okay. So now we know that we've got the log for the princess and we've got the arrows for the minion horde. If we can come back from this, I'll be very surprised because uh, he's got a lot of uh, air air units. As a matter of fact, is he running a lava hound deck? He's got the inferno dragon. He's got a very good counter to us. I really shouldn't even be playing that. I need to save the lightning for the inferno dragon with... Uh... Why is the... Or so slower. That was nice. We he, he was ahead by three elixir and he dropped that princess right there. And now we're back. So now we know no we are not gonna play the bowler. He must have been sitting on elixir or something. We are not going to play the boulder. Put the Mega Minion back there. Right, he's gonna keep wasting elixir. That was bad. He's not gonna win. Yeah. So that deck was actually really not a good deck for us uh, that we're playing against. We're not playing. I mean, he's got that minion horde that chopped us up. So now we know. See, I should have been having my arrows like hovering for whenever I cross the bridge. I had that ready, but. If you notice my cards were out of rotation, so I had the lightning, but I didn't have the arrows. So, even against a deck that actually counters us well, I don't know if that guy had a very... I bet he's around 3k. Yeah, he's running a Lava Hound Blue deck. I guarantee that guy's about a 3k player. Wow, only 2300. So, yeah, I was, the reason I said that is I saw his level 6 furnace, and no 4k players have a level 6 furnace, but he never got to play his Lava Hound, which is actually interesting, because... That's his best card, um, so I don't know why he wasn't playing his Lava Helm. But, uh, there's the deck, guys. We got three wins with it, so I don't think we did that bad. Uh, I try to keep these videos to around three wins. Let me know in the comment section below. If I do, like, a full challenge for a video, it'll probably take, like, 30 minutes, 45 minutes. I don't know. But if you want me to do a full challenge for a video, I'll do it. Let me know in the comment section below if you would watch it. And again, thank you guys. Remember, the teamwork makes dreams work. Tell all of your clanmates about the channel. I'll do bigger and bigger tournaments the more people that come and subscribe. Have them come and leave a comment on the Clash Royale videos. And if I can start getting these Clash Royale videos up to 1,000 views. Because, I mean, I get, you know, 1,000 views in the first 8 hours on Clash of Kings. But if I can get over 1,000 views on Clash Royale, I'll be very, very happy. I just, um, I'm very discouraged doing the Clash Royale videos because... They're just sitting on my channel with like, you know, four or five hundred views and it's uh, it hurts to look at I haven't been the small small guy in a little while. So um, yeah, it gives me something to work for though So thank you guys so much. Uh, I'll see you in the next video. Peace